So I'm going to rearrange a little bit of the code. So I'm going to create a function or method called on paint and of course the event and uh, here I'm going to create a boolean called self.init self.init and it will be false and here in the on paint an if statement so if not self.init then uh, self.init gl this method uh, doesn't exist yet self.init gl and self.init yeah set it to true and here I'm going to call the on draw on draw self dot on draw self dot on draw so this event paint I'm going to set instead of on draw to on paint uh, so this on draw doesn't need anymore this event and uh, and let let me explain uh, before I start to define this init gl function uh, what happening here so init starts as false so we are asking that if not false which is true then call the init gl and set init to true and then call the on draw so it ensures that this init gl is called only once so let's start to uh, define that init gl so define init gl and the first thing i'm going to create are the vertices so vertices so trian, triangle equals a list a list and the first vertex will be uh, negative 0 0.5 on x, negative 0 0.5 on y, and 0, 0.0 on the z. And its color will be 1 uh, red, uh, 0 green, and 0 blue. The next vertex will be 0 0.5 on x and negative 0 0.5 on y and 0, 0.0 on z and its color will be 0 on red 1 green and 0 blue of course we need here and here commas and the third vertex will be 0, 0.0 on x, 0, 0.5 on y, and 0, 0.0 on z. And its color will be red 0, green 0, and blue 1. So I'm just going to a little bit rearrange this to see it better. So I'm going to give it here that these are the vertex uh, or the vertex positions or just vertices and 
So these are the vertices and uh, these are the colors. Okay, so now we define those that uh, this is a Python list and we cannot send Python list into Py OpenGL, so we need to convert this list uh, into a NumPy array, so triangle equals NumPy, of course I need to import NumPy, import NumPy, so into NumPy.array, NumPy.array, uh, triangle, and uh, D type type equal to numpy dot float float 32 so we are ready with the vertices and in next video I am going to define the sh create the shaders